to our maximum temperature now of uh, 35 degrees C. Um, also, there are some, you might notice this little light going on and off. That means that it's controlling at the set point. Um, as you can see here, we're just a little bit above by our, uh, our external temperature probe. Now what we're going to do is we're going to go down to the lowest temperature, which is 5 degrees C. And we'll just wait for a minute here just to make sure it's off and running. You might be able to hear the compressor start to kick on. The reservoir itself is six gallons. Uh, we have it about two-thirds full, so it's about five gallons in there. Probably running through our test loop here, maybe about another gallon or so. So we probably have about five and a half to six gallons. Now, if you'd like, we can just stay here for a few minutes and watch this go down. Um, very strong compressor. It moves very quickly. temperature could come down. Uh, this has a, as I mentioned, a PD2 pump, which will put out about three and a half gallons per minute at 50 PSI. This is my little throttle valve that I have here, my little homemade device that works very well. So I'm going to raise this up and push this to about halfway between about 50. And we are just under three and a half, about three and a quarter uh, gallons per minute, which is pretty good. Uh, the lines can be a little bit bigger, but for the test loop that we have, I think that's pretty good. We'll step back and see how we're doing here. We're on our way down. We still have a little bit to go. All the way down, but while we're waiting, this cover here can be lifted up taken off. And if you have to clean out, and we'll blow this out before we send it out the door, you can uh, vacuum or clean out your condenser coil here. And this cover just, I like the way this fits. You slip it up top here. Just about there. And 
here we go. We're all the way down to temperature. This is a very simple chiller to program and use. Um, it fits well in uh, most facilities because it's, the size of this is, is pretty accommodating for the amount of power and output that it has. And this will complete this demonstration.